Stop <laughs> pushing me. No, because that's for the last one. Then. My mm -hmm. bitch your ass. How's up, y'all? How's up, y'all? This is the basic bitch. Anyways, stop Ooh, touching me. Uh, anyways, we back with another video and this ugly raggedy bitch right here is gonna introduce her raggedy ass self. Anyways. Hey, Mama. Hey, Mama. Bitches, you gonna talk with the sit there. Hey, bitch, I ain't raggedy. If you gonna call me a bitch, put that in front of it. Bitch, that's me. You talking about me. Why you keep touching me? Anyway, so, so it's your girl, aka your mother never the taught you to the uh, yo. <laughs> your mama never teach you to that and keep your hands to yourself. Apparently, your mama didn't teach you to do that. Bitch, so I never touched you. You did. I don't touch you did. dirt. <laughs> I'm not dirty. Why are you rubbing on me? I'm not rubbing you. Yeah, I'm gonna you for that fire. I'm a trick. I'm not like Beyonce on the weekend. Well, you need to stop touching me because you're gonna create a damn fire and I don't want to get burnt. What you trying to say, bitch? Come bit like a pogo stick, bitch. <laughs> bitch, stump up me. Can we get into the video? Because you. I don't like you sometimes, bitch. I, don't I just like want to let you know that, bitch. I don't like you. But I'm letting you know right now, bitch. I'm Beyonce, I'm Beyonce. and you are Michelle slash Kelly, bitch. Oh, you mean the crackhead Michelle? Because that's you. <laughs> no, bitch, that's you. No, you, you. crackhead Michelle? Just because the crackhead. I saw you standing on the side of the road with the crackhead. And I saw you standing in the store. Don't help in your life. Bitch, you probably was talking about in 2002, bitch, when I was young. <laughs> I was talking about candy out there and roses, bitch. But don't play with me. I hope the law enforcement me. <laughs> Like they gon' look back then to them camera shit, bitch. He stole a pack of gum cause that breath was hot. I bitch, seen him no, I stole a pack of some. Skittles, bitch. He I stole that deal stuff cause Doug just wanted that popular. <laughs> then he was stealing that deal stuff. Bitch, stuff. don't you ever to watch talk that me, ass. <laughs> Anyways. Bitch, you was stealing What was you trying to create? What you mean create? Hey, I was walking around You know what she was trying to He was trying to get everybody to taste the I was five, bitch. I didn't know I was done when I was a kid. Wait, I said 2000, so I was... Bitch, let me stop telling my business. Anyway, <laughs> um... <Bad>. Ciao! <laughs> now, let's get into the video. Tall French with them racks. Girl talk video. Y'all, before we. Girl talk. It's girl talk. Okay. Anyway, um, chill. <laughs> um, before we get to the video, make sure you guys like, comment, and what? Subscribe. To the channel, period. Um, make sure you guys watch the video with a friend or family member. Watch it with your whole family because they might have opinion on what we got to talk about in this girl top video um so let's get into this video the girl top video topic of today is how to maintain a healthy friendship um yeah, as you can see this friendship right here is just toxic i don't like this bitch sometimes like, i like close that bitch in the box because bitches be really trying me Girl, you look tried with that makeup. Anyway, Anyways, child. <laughs> Anyways, um. So, do you want to start? Go first. Or you wanna I'm go gonna first? go first. Okay, right. So, I would say how to maintain a healthy friendship is, you know, keep for number one, keep your circle small. They can't see your finger. They can't go for it. Okay, go ahead. Okay. I, keep your circle small, number Period. one. Because everybody ain't your what? Friend. Okay. I don't got time for this. She say, she said this, she said that. That's how things mm -hmm. get started, and that's how your friendship broke up. I promise you. Because ever since me and this whole been friends, we had people left and right, even to this day, like left and right. Because it's like, People got a jealousy thing of what we got going on. Like, you can be our friend, just don't be messy. Like, we don't need that. Mm -hmm. My number one, his number one rule is you only get one time with me. Period. I'm learning that slowly, apparently. Because. Friend, 
she working on it, y'all. So I'd be like, Friend. but I have not been getting close to nobody at all. She really haven't, but. But I'm proud of her on that because I'd be like, friend, that's not your friend. God be like, the so-called people she was calling her friend would come to me be talking so-called-ish about her. And I'd be like, uh-uh, you not about to be talking about her to me. Go tell her what you got. Even though I'm going to have her back what you about to say, even if you're right about what you're saying, even if they will be like, oh, Quay, doing such and such, Quay, doing this, this, and that, and they're right about it, still go talk to Quay. I'm not saying they're right about what they're saying about you. What I'm saying is, even if they was right, even if, if they, they have a problem with me, address right, it to address me. Right, address it to Quay. Don't come to me about what the problem Even if you want to say, I agree with what you're saying. Some things I did agree with, yes, about, you know, something that you were doing in the past, friend, but we're going to get all into that. What I'm saying is, don't be talking, don't, you can say your opinion about what you feel like Quay is doing wrong. I mean, I'm not saying Quay, what your friend is doing wrong, but don't go to somebody else and say, oh, talk, you had to extra step into the pot when you don't have to. Just say what your concerns or what you don't like about what that person is doing, then go to that person and let them know what you're talking about. But we can not wait to talk to y'all. Um, I feel like a toxic Friendship, I mean, how to maintain a healthy friendship is getting some space sometimes. You understand? Because, let me explain. Okay, sometimes friends need some space. Just like in a relationship, y'all not going to want to be all up on each other all the time. That's why sometimes I be at this end of the house and I be at the other end of the house sometimes. I don't know that she, if I want Bother this whole easy text mission. I'm not coming all the way to the other side of the house. Just say, bitch, get up. Right, what? but what I'm saying is sometimes you need space because sometimes your nerves get bad and you want to cuss them out for no reason and then it'd it be a whole it argument be a whole chaos. for no reason. And then that's how the next person oh, be like, oh, such and such caught an attitude with me. I don't right. know what the problem right. is. And yeah. then they go there instigating stuff. That's ain't why you got gotta, that's, but anybody who will, as what I'm saying is, right. with you and that other friend, you and that other friend, I'm saying you and your best friend, we ain't talking about friends, best friend, someone you're real close with. Y'all, to maintain, I feel like to maintain a healthy relationship is space. You're going to need some space sometimes because y'all are going to clear. It don't matter two males or two girls or a boy and a girl, whoever. Make sure y'all get some space sometimes because y'all calling each other on the phone every day is y'all gonna argue about it. And then y'all gonna argue about something. You're gonna mm -hmm. argue about something. But sometimes you're gonna need some space to like just chillax, be to yourself, stuff like that. So when you come back, y'all in a good mood or not probably good, y'all just good. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's how I feel about it. And then you get what I'm saying, or you got something to add to that. You get what I'm saying? So, at not even just space, sometimes um, to maintain a healthy relationship, a healthy friendship, is that y'all can, um, some people say therapy, but y'all ain't gotta go therapy. I feel like y'all too, if y'all supposed to be best friends or friends, y'all can come together to talk about any concerns, any problems. Y'all should be talking about anything. If that's your friend, that should be your homegirl, homeboy. Whoever we talk to the homegirls, call each other, call or whatever, or come see each other when y'all link back or whatever. You got any concerns, anything like that? Let your friend know. One thing about it is, if you want to keep a healthy relationship, don't keep anything in. Let your friend know what you like. If your friend did something that you didn't like, don't wait until such and such. Don't go to nobody else. Go to your actual friend or best friend. Who I'm going to say friend. Go to your actual friend and let them know what your concern or problem is. So, it don't have for nobody else. Don't hear it on the streets. Don't hear it for nobody. So, let them know. So, you can be like, oh, I heard from such and such. You was talking to my me. You was saying that. No. Go to your best friend or your friend. Let them know right then and there. Friend, go ahead. Um, another thing. Know how to keep up. You know, maintain a healthy friendship is trust. Because trust, yes. Um, I got to be at, for us to be friends, I got to be able to trust you because I can't be with no sneaky, no sneaky person. I but told you, this help if I can't trust you to hold twenty dollars for me for a week, then bitch, I'm not. I know we not even be friends. Know. Not even that. Like if I can't even trust you with some type of information, it's definitely if it's right. secretive. I can't trust like, you at all. Like, I was, I was um, 
watching something that was like if if my friend would have tell me they had herpes you the if she would have tell me I'm not saying she does she doesn't have anything y'all just to just an example <laughs> if she was to tell me but listen hold on friend if she was to tell me she had a std i'm not gonna dig on i'm gonna keep that to myself i'm not that's something she was like okay if friends tell me not to tell nobody anything i'm not gonna say nothing but you know when to not say anything. Like she would be like, friend, I got I caught such and such. I know not to go tell nobody. Point of period. You gotta know to trust that person. You that means she trusts in me to come tell me this information. She ain't have to tell me that because I'm not sleeping with her. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? So and we should food and drinks and shit, be So bitch, what? she gonna come tell me. But at the same time, she felt comfortable and she trusted me to tell me this information. She would expect me not to go put it on the internet, go tell nobody. So basically, uh, keeping everybody out your business and keep that loyalty that y'all have together because mm -hmm. the moment, like, I want to say the moment we got out of school, people was like literally hating on this because we always together. Oh, why y'all doing this? Oh, y'all don't ever call us. Or they'd get mad at friends and be like, well, you don't ever hit me up. Oh, you thought she was cute. Like, jealousy. Like, baby, mm -hmm. that don't run over here. We don't... One thing about me and friend, if friend can get it, I know I can get it. And if I know I can get it, my friend can get it. Just like if I don't have any money, my friend gonna look after me. And if I got money, I'm gonna look up after my friend because that's what loyalty and that's what a healthy friendship is. You're gonna, look, up, you're gonna look after one another. You're gonna make sure each other is straight. Mm -hmm. Just like we get this together, honey. We, mm -hmm. If I get famous, my friend gonna be famous. That's how we write. Period. But, um, you know, child, I don't... I would trust that you are supposed to trust your best friend or your friends because, like, in the beginning, she said everybody's not your friend. So, make sure your so-called friends is your friends, mm -hmm. first of all, because... Watch your child, friends, definitely. It's... Mm -mm. And that's what's wrong with a lot of girls. If y'all ever pay attention to your social media and you always see these group of girls and they doing this and they doing that, here goes that person sharing this. And I pay attention to that a lot. They be like, oh, well, I don't got no friends. But ask yourself, why don't you have those friends? Because you hanging out, especially if you hanging with a group of girls. It could be just mm -hmm. one girl. And they causing that trouble. Dudes too. And, like, I would hate to say it, but it de it, it definitely comes from, like, the streets, the, the ghetto. I don't talk about where I'm from. Baby, I, <laughs> if I could rewind back to time, I wish I was never from there. Like, mm -hmm. baby, that's because you from there don't mean you got to act like it. Period. But, but child. You know worth Definitely. Period. Please make sure you guys comment below and let us know what you guys think about this topic because maybe y'all will know something that we don't know. Maybe um y'all can talk about something. I mean, y'all can give us some opinion by yours and we're that going to learn ourselves, sure. But, um, yeah. Oh, you but know. we do. We just want to let y'all know we do have a healthy friendship. Yes. Very. And, and the friendship, you're going to get in each other's nerves sometimes, child. Cause you're getting on my nerves now. Girl, fuck you <laughs> in the ground. You walk out on beach. Anyways, Anyways, like like we said, we just the same way we add on camera, the same way we add off camera. Sure, we gonna add the same anyway. We got sure, mm -hmm. girl. Cause I ain't got time for the fakeness, the the the, the raggediness, the everything, all, the get on this girl, child. The Anyways, home. eat all the above. Child. I was with that. Uh, how bitch, your phone supposed to be on Do Not Disturb. It's how? on Do Not Disturb. So why are you looking at your phone? Because it was bitch? falling and I was picking it up. Oh. Like you be chopping this up. Anyway. Oh, child. I ain't uh, never been a jail sweetie. Ain't nobody said you did. I ain't never dropped no stuff. Anyway. Um, I dropped the bottle shit. of soap. I use dough. I don't use dough. I don't use this. I got sensitive skin. Ain't nothing wrong with it, child. Yeah, but send me scratch on my arm. I have eczema, so it's definitely like the lotion. I ain't got shit, bitch. Don't you ever. I ain't said that. What you talking about? Come on, damn hurt. I ain't saying nothing about not hurt. Yes, you did. I don't know who you think you yelling at, but bitch, you need to. I almost said your girl's on camera, but you better calm down. Calm down, ho. 
Because I'm not the one. Oh, I ain't the Anyways, one. Anyways, um, child, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and always remember your haters is always watching. So stay in your bag because what they hate saying you in Yo. your motherfucking bag. And that's on what? Period. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.